You may know that Cardhop's developer Flexibits also makes a very popular calendar application called Fantastical. Starting with Cardhop version 2.0, the developers have figured out a way to take advantage of both applications. I'm in Cardhop now and I'm going to create a new group and it's going to be a subgroup of my Area 51 group. It's going to be the Area 51 managers, so I'll just call it 51 managers. Now once I'm done, I'm going to drag a few of the contacts from Area 51 to the 51 managers. So now I have a group of just managers. It's just these three people. Using card hop, I can just type the word invite at the top of the screen, and then with a slash, select the 51 managers group. Once I do that, it opens a new event in Fantastical that's ready to go for me with invitations already set. I just have to add the event description, the time, and the date. And when I'm done, I've created a new event that sends the invites out to that 51 managers group. You can do this with Cardhop with any size group. I've just got three in this group, but you could have one with 100 and it would still work. It's an awesome new feature that not only works on the Mac, but also on the iPad and the iPhone. Now let's take a look at this feature over on the iPhone. I've got the iPhone up now and the feature works exactly the same. I'm going to create a new event. I'm going to type invite and then slash 51 to pick the group. And now I can type in the rest of the details and create an event. And the best part is the invitees are already added. Once I click add event, you'll see that the invitations have already gone out the door. This is a great way to leverage the power of Cardhop and Fantastical together. <music>